Yo, DJ, put a nigga back to the record, baby, and give me this right now. Infinite Warfare. Man, where do I start? Well, there isn't a fact. Or actually, there's a fact. Now, I don't hate the game. Not the franchise. But the way you have used your marketing skills. Like, I'm not going to say that, like, I'm not going to try and compare Infinite Warfare to BF1. Because I am. In fact, I'm also contrasting it in the ways that they have used their marketing skills over the years. And my opinions will also be stated in this video, too. So stay tuned, and um, I'll just let you guys know what I think about these two games. I've kind of forgot what all of my opinions were, but the biggest one is this game is good. I'm not hating it. Just like I said earlier, I'm not trying to hate it. What I'm saying is that it could have been better, and it could have been pushed off farther beyond these years, maybe about like two or three years from now simply because they could have waited to make up these futuristic games like Battlefield Back like Battlefield Back Company 2 all the way from there me playing that to Black Ops 2 it was good not futuristic at all to Battlefield 3 and 4 and 1 to Battlefield not Battlefield but um Call of Duty Infinite Warfare Black Ops 3 Advanced Warfare if you compare those two, you'll see that um, Battlefield has been keeping the old vibe as long as possible, and they're probably going to try to keep it for as long as possible. And to be honest, they're probably going to do it, and it's going to help their marketing so well. And that's what really hit me whenever I thought about how Call of Duty could have done this too. They could have kept the old vibe, they could have kept everything the way it was, and they would have had no problem with their marketing. And when they ran out of ideas, they could have done the futuristic one. Because if you ever do anything futuristic, you can make about anything up. You can make you can make about anything up as you go. You can be like, hey, this is in the future. Ain't it cool? Yeah, it is, because it's futuristic. It's not in the real world. In real life, we can actually see where they have failures and stuff, which is probably why they started making futuristic ones, because I don't know. what What I'm thinking is that it's just it's just insane it's just insane to think that why they don't they don't use this stuff they don't think they don't think to themselves what is this going to do to us in the future they just think we got to give them innovation innovation is like they could use in the future they could use innovation in the future but no they don't want to do that they want to use futuristic stuff they want to use everything new and use an excuse like they're based on war stories I guarantee you it's not going to be anything close to it. You know why? Because I'm sure they didn't have jetpacks, like, because we don't have them now, unless there's something I don't know. But just like that, there's just so many things I could talk about like that. Like, just their marketing skills are terrible, but Battlefield 1 is keeping it good, so i got to say that. Um, my hand has to go towards, of course, Battlefield. There's some reasons why I would love Infinite Warfare more which is like it's more fast paced but I don't really like fast paced so I have to say that Battlefield 1 is my type of game many of you guys hope you liked that video make sure to tap that like button for more um, if you thought any of my ideas was truthful and probably a good idea just um, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new we'll see you guys in the next video this is Captain Atha signing off one more thing guys um, there's the beta Titanfall 2 Battlefield 1 and Infinite Warfare full matches coming out possibly. I might not do the Infinite Warfare um, beta videos though because the servers weren't that well, but maybe I have a clip or two um, or a match or two that have perfect servers and um, they'll be out as soon as possible. See you guys in the next video. This is Captain Atha signing off.